terminal will have a floor plan. Then we can find a data vault. Whoever placed a Sansana shipment in the ventilation channel, please contact the maintenance crew. If this had been left unattended, the results could have been disastrous to say the least. Am I in the wrong place? Holy shit. It's a risk really you could always request a transfer. I've considered it, but... But you're getting used to the life the extra money affords, aren't you? What can I say? Thornton makes it very difficult to me. That's our terminal. Because we can't have pikes just wandering around this station. Yes, which is why we don't. This is a tight operation. <laughs> Okay, data vault, data vault, it's in the maintenance bay. All right, let's get that door open. Hey, Kay, the officer's inspecting the goods. You found the files? No, keep her busy. I was just thinking, the Pikes run Miragana. Maybe instead of deleting their debts, you frame Crimson Dawn, tell Gorak everything, and get a big reward. Double cross Alira? Think about it. What's stopping her from cashing in on your death mark? Hey, I never told you about my death mark. Where it gets around, Kay. Oh, wait, she's coming back. Showtime, Nix. <laughs> Don't let it get away. Might have to make a really, really risky move here. Hey, buddy. I don't know where that camera is controlled from. So interestingly, we're what? We're being faced with a choice of either we can double cross the Pike or double cross Crimson Dawn and get favor with the Pikes, which I do kind of want to do because I want that Imperial uniform. I don't know what we're doing here, man. I don't know. I don't know what choice to go for. Crimson Dawn's cool. Like they've got really sleek you can look looking outfits, but. And you know, like Darth Maul and shit. How you doing, fella? Behind you! 
behind you. Huh? Okay, that was kind of slick. I ain't even gonna lie. That was that was pretty slick. Disable that alarm, okay? Oh, what the hell? Nix. Nix, I need you to go and get that shield then, if you wouldn't mind. Go through there, go around, get the shield. I'll get that guy. Knock, knock. Oh, no. Security cameras, maintenance energy barrier. I feel like we want to do that one first. Because if I get it wrong, we have a problem. You, 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 and you. All right, that one's in the right place. That's good. You, you, you. That one's not in the right place. We'll go there. It's still not in the right place. God damn it. Barriers off. Security cameras are off as well. Oh, I can turn both of them off. Okay. I didn't hack both. Just one. That's good. The hell does this do? As you should all be aware, the intrepid will soon dock, and Admiral Veneer himself will grace us with his presence. Your orders are to service and refuel the intrepid as swiftly and efficiently as possible, whilst drawing as little attention as possible to our secondary operations. What are their secondary time. operations here? Like. You're right. Have they all turned around? I think they have. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, we're through. Hmm. The floor plan said the data vault's here somewhere. Probably there? Yeah, probably. Gotta stay stealthy while doing all of this. Now, hear me out. Activate. There's a fucking probe or a thingy droid right there. I get over there. Got ambushed by rebels. Before we can shoot back. Oh, that was close. Oh, oh, oh. I don't know if I can jump that. And if I can't jump that, I'm going to set off the alarms, which is kind of a problem. We're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. Is that something I can cut across? Yes, it is. Oh, I don't like that. All right, down we go. We're good. Oh, we got across there. We got an Imperial. Have I got a stun? I don't think I do. All right, next little buddy, old pal. I'm gonna need you to do me a favor, and I'm gonna need you to do it quick. To them, Get over there. Don't let it get away. <laughs> All right. 
I really don't like the idea of it just dropping the blaster rifle all of a sudden. I'm not sure how I feel about that. Data vault. Okay, let's wipe some debts. This seems too easy. This seems too easy. Why are we just walking in here? Come on, come on. Oh, these oh, files hell. are impossible to understand. What are you one of Thornton's guys? Whoa. Uh yes? No, you are an intruder. And if you don't want me to sound the alarm, you'll get me out of here. I'm sorry, you are? Boss Knock. I am Thurden's bookkeeper. A fancy name for a prisoner. I thought prisoners were usually in, you know, cells. They call it creative punishment. It's what I get for being so smart. All the governor's bribes, kickbacks, shady deals, they all go through me. Okay, we gotta hurry this up. Just pick who you want to pin this on. Uh, let's help each other then. Scrub some records for me and I'll get you out of here. Dirty data. Easy. And what in it? Oh, God. I don't know. <laughs> I don't care for the huts. I'm gonna frame Crimson Dawn. All right, boss knock. Erase Crimson Dawn's debts on Tashara. Gordon's not gonna like that, which means I love it. The Dawn better be ready for what's coming. I'll wipe the files and meet you in my extraction cruiser. Extraction cruiser? I've had a long time to plan this intruder. Get it moving from that terminal behind you. Oh boy. Okay, Bosnock. What do I do? Call the cargo elevator. You did it, intruder. It's moving. Great. And my name is Kay. Yeah, whatever. All right. Let me guess. I need to go down there and hit the button on that thing now. Hey, so extraction cruiser is acting up. I need a push here. There's a button on the back. <laughs> Boy, it needs a power surge. Doesn't that mean I just need to shoot it with this? Oh, I don't know about that. I'll turn the fucking cameras off. There. You good? Yes, yes. Follow me. I will lead us out of here. Let me guess. Can't go through here. I thought you had this all planned out. I Kay, get back here. The imp's not buying it. Uh, what? I've locked the trailblazer down, but they're trying to pry her doors open. Hurry up. I'm coming. I'm coming. Oh, hell. Ready? Yeah, yeah. Let's go. I got it, boss knock. Someone nearby? All fine so far. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. 
We're escorting a head in a jar. Wouldn't it be faster if I carried you? What? I'm not leaving my stuff here. Hey, uh, the other door didn't open. You sure you pushed the right button? I'm learning as I go here, Bosnok. Wait. Okay, here we go. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, hey, hey. What you do? I'm falling. <laughs> I don't know what happened. I, I pushed a button. Find me! Intruder! You have to get down here! Hey, so how'd you end up here? An elf with no sense of humor caught me down in the back guards. Hey, intruder, someone's coming. I... Bosnok, you there? Uh-oh. I asked you what you're doing here. How the hell do I get over there? I'm calling this in. I'm not letting you out of my sight. That's it. I'm sounding the alarm. Should have remembered that I can fight them without, you know, sounding the alarm. <laughs> according to plan. I don't know about that. I don't know that everything's going according to plan right now. I'm escorting a big head out of here, and I, I don't, I don't know about that. Did that work? There he is. Sounds like you need to override the cargo authorization. Hmm, I heard. Where's the hangar control bay? Up ahead. Move, trooper. There's a possible intruder near the cargo bay. Okay. Please just run past me. Okay. Nix, get that terminal. We got some officers there. We got a trooper there. We got a loot crate right over at the other side here. Uh, I can probably take you all out quick enough that I won't get alerted. Yeah. Easy. Give me whatever this is. 500 credits. Don't mind if I do. We're not getting through that hangar with all those troopers. Maybe we can get them out of here. Square, square, uh, circle. Okay, so you go somewhere else. Circle, circle, that. Oh, nice. 
Activate evacuation. Approve. Okay, so approve cargo. Uh, okay. One. Oh, biological sample to be shipped. <laughs> that should work. Oh, the stormtroopers are clearing out down there. This is our chance next. Let's get back to the ship. Get the hell out of here. You okay, Nix? We'll be fine, buddy. Hey! Uh, hi there. Waka! Waka, drop the cargo ramp. Let us in. Us? Who's us? Just open the ramp. It's not going well. Something's wrong. It's jammed. Next little buddy, I really could use a better gun. Start. If you want to live through this, you'll get that thing open. It's not my fault. I told you she wasn't ready. Just figure it out. No! There's a lot of troopers out here. God damn it! Mox, thank you so much for the 53 months. I appreciate you. All right, we need to take down this, that guy's shield. I told you she wasn't ready. Just figure it out. There's a lot of troopers out here. There's really not that many troopers out here, to be quite honest. find and intruder at once. Get that damn door open. Oh. We've lost 
them. We did it. We did it. And who's this guy in the jar? Uh, Bosnock. 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 Good. Yeah. Great. Get close to the relay and I can wipe the system. Just need a few seconds. Uninterrupted. Quick. Oh, that was kind of neat. I kind of hope we do get to a point where I can go and pick and choose when to do this kind of stuff. I imagine we will, because we had that one quest to go out to one station and get a key card or something. And no, he is not. See how Gorak reacts to all this. All right. Well, I'm sure they'll let you play Sabak. However, it is you do that. That seemed to go well. I'll be back soon. Uh, don't trash the place, Bosnak. Hey, so when can I leave Tashara? Okay. First of all, the Trailblazer needs some much-deserved rest and relaxation. It's a ship. Ah. Uh, Hurt ship. She needs patience, time, and me. You can't rush this. Okay, I get it. All right. Can't believe you pulled that off, intruder. Now, where are you going to take me? Uh, I'm gonna see if the Pikes will look after you. Might need to earn your keep, though. You know how much info I got on Forden and his operation. They'll be begging to keep me around. Thank you, Key. Hey, you're, uh, you're welcome. All right. So I guess we'll see how thrilled to see me Gorak happens to be. Can I do anything with the ship yet? Ship pods available. No. I guess the ship has to be fully repaired before we can do that. Man, we're coming up on five and a half hours into this, and... We still have shit locked. Which, I mean, makes sense, because I did do a bunch of side quests, but, you know. I'm a little busy right now. Yeah, you any good at Savak? What? Uh, yeah, I'm from Canto Bight. Good. I got some high rollers looking for a challenge at McCall's. Go take their money. <laughs> All right. Don't know if I want to do Sabak. I'm gonna be honest with you. I really don't. I I don't know how to play it. But maybe we try. If I can find the table. Oh, well, that's not where we need to go. Interested in some second rate slicer. I was content that she's not taking any jobs. Perhaps I should have a few words with 
Interesting. Where the hell are these high rollers that want to play Sabak? Fast travel point, exit, false flag. You know what? We'll leave it be for now. We'll just do the quest. I am sure this will go well. Sorry to interrupt, Gorak. I can see that you... Why are you here? I, uh, got you a new bookkeeper. I wasn't aware I needed one. Yeah, that's the thing. Crimson Dawn hired me to frame you, but, but, instead, I framed them. This bookkeeper, Bosnock, he wants protection. He worked for Thornton, knows every deal the governor's made with your competition. <laughs> we'll look after this, Bosnock. But tell me, why the gift? Hmm, just a favor. Then you should know. A bounty hunter working for Zarek Besh has been asking about your death mark. She calls herself Vale. Vale? Huh, I'll keep an eye out. Thanks. I repay favors, KVS. All right, the Pikes are happy with me. Crimson Dawn isn't. They're very not happy with me. That's all right. I can I can deal with that. How are we doing with the Pikes though? That is the real question. Shadows of deceit. Ah, this might be the uh, the gambling thing. Who the hell are you? Gorak's got money. We don't have a lot of options. We can find a way off world. Kira's vision is much bigger than Toshara. What Crimson Dawn did to the Sabarians was ruthless. I'd rather smuggle spice than be a part of that. Hmm, sounds like you two are between a rock and a hard place. Let's ask her. Hey, who would you work for? Hmm. Neither. Neither of them. And I think you're better off making your own way. You have no idea how things work in this city. All right, don't fucking ask me next time then. Where the hell are these high rollers? Hey, buddy. And you are? Kves. I was invited by Danka. Oh, really? Uh, all right, then. Thank you. <laughs> so, what do all the symbols mean? <laughs> Seriously? Danka invited you. <laughs> yeah. Name's KVS. Ready to play? Oh boy. 300 credits, buy in 100 credits. We got cheats available. Deal sure. me in. Don't know how Sabak works. Is that a two and a three? the rules in castle sabak you invest your chips to improve your hand and get a pair and get a pair of sabak hand to win a round you need to have the best hand at the end of three turns the last player with chips and stock wins the game and the content and credit the pot there are so many rules jesus christ hands are made of two cards one from each family sand and blood with values going from one to six the value is depicted by its header and central symbol there are three cards for each value per family minimize your hand value 
Minimize your hand value, meaning the difference of your card values. A sabak hand, a sabak hand is a pair and has a hand value of zero. So six minus five is one, two minus two is zero. When revealed, the Psylocke will take the value of the other card in your hand, forming a pair and a Sabak, Sabak hand. There's one Psylocke per family. Castle Sabak is played with sh three shift tokens, which are powerful game modifiers. A shift token can be played once in the game and only at the beginning of your turn before standing or drawing. You can display the active shift tokens with the right bumper. Draw and stand. To draw a card, you must invest one chip. Standing will pass return for free, seven chips when your hand is good enough. Each round lasts three turns, giving you three opportunities to improve your hand. After each player has played three times, everyone reveals their hands. You win the round if you have the best hand at the table. So the best hand is the smallest hand value. Yes, if no one has a Spock hand, the player with the lowest hand value, the difference of the cards, using the lowest cards, wins. During your turn, you can send Nyx to try peeking at your opponent's hands. Failing this cheat will increase their suspicion. Failing at cheating increases suspicion, eventually getting you caught and banned from the table. You'll need to wait for things to calm down before coming back. Okay, so lowest hand wins. I have a two and a three, so I have a one currently. Invest chips to improve your hand and get a pair. To win a round, you need to have a pair. So back hand closest to zero. The last player with chips in stock wins the game in the credit pot. Okay, so I have um I have one currently. Uh, I have six credits as well. I'm gonna stand where I am. I think standing with one yeah, is fine. Right, so you have a you have a five. I draw. You're drawing a blood card, which is three. Draw. You're drawing a blood card, which is a six. I'm gonna stand again. I think I think a one is a is a pretty good number currently. Pass. I'll draw. All right. I think I'm gonna stay on one. Pass. I'll stand. Draw. This guy to the right isn't doing so good, apparently. Okay, so now we reveal the cards, which gives me a one, right? You. Oh, it's a It's the lower cards. God damn it! You're a sabak as well. So you're a zero. Fuck. Takes an invested chips back to the stock. Without a Sabak hand, you are taxed an amount equal to the difference of your card values. With that, with a losing Sabak hand, you are taxed one chip. Okay. Good game, everyone. So I get a negative one, right? Yeah. All right. So that guy's out. That's fine. What am I looking at here? Six and one? Jesus. Oh, I don't like that. Draw. Oh, I can turn fast mode on. That's cool. Shift tokens or effect cards can only be played before draw or stand actions. Avoid the draw fee this turn. Retrieve two chips. Other players are taxed one chip. Let's do that. Take this. Because now that guy's down to one. You're down to four. Keeps me on five. Uh, I'm going to draw, though. Let's see. Give me a throw dice to set its value during a reveal. 
I want a new sand card. I want to discard you. I don't know what this card is. Refund two chips. Yeah. I think I'm going to refund two chips as well. So you're down to three. They're down to zero. If I can refund, I get two chips back. Uh, I only get one back. It's, this is the current amount in my pot. That's fine. That still gives me a pretty decent amount. Um, I don't know what this is. Imposter cards take the result value of a dice throw during the reveal. Oh, it's an imposter card. So I have a... I would assume a one in six chance of getting a one. Uh, draw. Draw. Is that a five? Is that telling me what I'd be drawing? Or I can draw a pair of imposter cards? Can I take this? What am I getting here? It's another imposter card. That's not... Okay, so those are imposter cards. That's not what I'm looking for at all. Um, yeah, confirm that. That was, that was a mistake. <laughs> that was not what I wanted to do at all. Okay, so is that what these are? These are imposter cards, and then that's another imposter card. Uh, avoid the draw fee this turn. Let's do that. Something good. Give me that, I guess. It's I are these all imposter cards? They are. I guess we roll the dice and see what happens. Imposter. You're rolling the dice. What are you getting? It's two dice. It's gonna be a minimum two. I got some box. You got a fucking one, really? Give me the die. What did I get? The dice have been thrown. Choose one of the combined values to replace the imposter and complete your hand. One. Gives me Sabak. Looks like it's my lucky day. So you get a plus four. I get a plus one. You're out. Okay. One on one, Sabak. Here we go. I got a two and a five. Shit. I draw. You can try to cheat by spending sending Nyx to spy on an opponent's card. I don't really want to do that. Come on. Now, if I draw, what is that? A six. Can I draw? No, I just realized what I've done. I can't replace. I have to, you have to have one of each, right? So me drawing another five there was stupid. Uh, damn it. Pass. Okay. I kind Let's... of need to draw because this will give me a one. But the cards are crazy high. Unless I draw an imposter and roll an imposter card and that give me a two what is that sign up cards wait sign up cards match the value of the other card in hand during the reveal phase uh, discard you so during the reveal it'll match you now have a sabak hand which is a pair of cards one from each deck the closer card values are to zero the stronger the hand is i'll stand I stand. So I have the Psylop, which means I should have a decent Sabak hand, but so do you. And your cards are lower. So I don't think I'm going to win. 
I also have Tabak. Silop Savak. All right. That's me. All right, over two. Um, what are my draw options right now? Come on. Oh, absolutely. That gives me a one and a one. So that gives me a Sabak hand with super low cards. Stand. I draw. Passing. Shift. I can't believe you just refunded two chips. God damn it. I have Sabak though, Sabak. right? I have Prime Sabak. You have Cheap Sabak. Cheap Sabak, which means I win Can't the round. Is that all I had to do? Win the round? Or do I have to put... I think she has to be out for me to win. What is this? That's a... That's a dice roll at the end there. New card. Was that a two? Two and a one. Give me a. I'm gonna give me a one. I don't like Sabak. I'm learning how to play it after Wrong. twenty something years. Something good. What are my options? That's a six. I don't want that. Uh... No, I think I stand. I don't think I have a yeah, choice. Stand. I draw. I think we just roll the dice at the end and see what happens. Probably shouldn't have used all of my um, special things, but whatever. I stand. Shift. Other players attack. I have no fucking chips. What do you mean? Draw. All right. I'll go for the reveal. I Give me the dice. Roll. I got a two. And I think that's a one. Yeah, so that gives me a one. You're a Sabak, really? Good game, everyone. Didn't I have to win, or was it just play around? The galaxy is full of castle spot challenges. Search for shift tokens and find new cheats by exploring the world. Find your strategy and play cell during your journey. Win a game against the high rollers is my current main quest. That is my main quest right now is win a game against the high rollers. You've got to be kidding me. Oh, okay, we'll do one more. We'll do one more, or I'm gonna kill them. <laughs> um, yeah. Room for one more. God damn it! What are we looking at? Two and a five. Shit. All right. I see another five there, which is good. All right. Oh no, sorry, another two. Yeah, give me the two. Uh, 
does. So put, we'll discard the five. Genie We'll speed it up as well. Next player must stand, you motherfucker. Um, I would like to retrieve my two chips. Actually, no, I'm kind of confident in my hand right now. So we're just gonna stand. We had to stand anyway. I'm not gonna do anything. We'll just, we'll just, we'll just stand. Okay. Okay, now I'd like to get my chips back. Sure. Uh, I can't select any others of these. That's fine. So we're going to continue to stand. Pass. You get your chips back as well. God damn it. Okay, so I have Sabak. You know what this You have Sabak. I have the lowest. You are going to roll. If you get a three, I still have the lowest Sabak. Get a five. And <laughs> you... Easy. Okay, so I won that round. Perfect. I have a six and a one. That's not good. Is that a one I just saw go, go down on the table? On. It is. Okay, so that gives me a prime Sabak. Take one chip from each player's pot. God damn it. I sort of want to... I sort of want to run these other players out of business here. So I'm gonna I'm gonna tax them. Some of them can't afford it. One of them can't afford it. The guy to my right is now broke. The one across from me has one left. The guy on my left is broke, and I have prime Sabak. So in theory, yes. I could wipe them all out by round three. Okay, we all get taxed a little bit. Whatever. Yeah, they're all broke now. <laughs> Set imposter value to six until next reveal. Yeah, they're all broke, and I still have cards. What does this do? Avoid draw fee. I don't need to worry about that. Confirm. Passing. All right. So you had Sabak. You have Sabak, but I have a Prime Sabak. Prime Sabak. Which should put that me to the top. Mine. And I think that knocks all of them out in round two. Oh, guess it's my lucky day. Well played. Donka was right about you. Interested in playing with the high rollers? Always. Donka's definitely got something for you. Oh, don't feel bad. I'm really good at this. Ugh. Okay, 300 credits. At least I made back what I lost the first one. Okay, you've impressed my associates. You know Bosnock? He's running a table over in Kozlo Sabak parlor. Bosnock? How did he get a table? His boss seems to like him. You win? I guess so. Guess I'll go see Bosnock again. Alright. I really don't like that I'm gonna be just gambling this entire time for the next like quest or two, but you know what? That's fine. I made like a hundred credits. I made like a hundred credits. I can I can deal with that. That's that's not so bad. I really hope that we have more than gambling ahead of us for this next quest, but you know. Getting picked up and I got paid. What's the next part you need? I can't stay on this moon any longer. Yeah, yeah. One thing at a time here. Before we get fixing the hyperdrive, you need to upgrade your speeder. What? Why? Just trust me. You need to find a mechanic to help you out. Uh, aren't you a mechanic? Yeah, a busy one. Ask around, you'll find someone. 
Danka had a contact. Yeah, that's true. We gotta go and figure out this mechanic business, I guess. Could mod my speeder, right? Sure did. Bartender at Jonta's Hope knows the mechanic, so start there. Jonta's Hope, right? I'm glad you called, Kay. You're starting to get a rep, which means more work. I got a nice curated list of jobs here for you, but I'm not the only one. Lots more people will hire you now. Oh, uh, thanks. I'll stop by. All right, so we need to go and find this mechanic now. So let's show that on the map, I guess, and track it. Is it this guy? Contract broker. Crimson Dawn aren't going to be happy to see me, though. It's kind of a problem. Who? That's not what I'm looking for. Yeah, that's not what I'm looking for either. I'm looking specifically for... Uh, if we go out to the other map here... Aren't we looking to go to... Jaunta's Hope and speak to the guy down there? What's the what's the main quest we have? So the main quest we have right now is this... High stakes thing. But we also have this contact. And I think I'd like to... Do this? Oh wait, no. We need to boost the speeder as well. We need to do both of these. So that's the slicer, that's the speeder. Let's do the speeder one. Because I think that kind of makes a bit more sense. Davis, there's something I'd like you to take care of. What? You got a job for me? I want to talk in person. Meet me at McCall's. All right. It feels like things are opening up a little bit now. We're starting to get more quests coming at us. We're starting to see more, more stuff happening, which is great. Okay. I mean, I guess, I guess we got work to do, right? That's, that's, that's where we're at. We got, a, we got a lot of work to do. But it ain't going to be 